Good afternoon, this is Karen Gustin with the Kentucky Equine Adoption Center and we are here with part two of our horse country tour brought to you virtually by us here at the center and this section is going to focus on training. That's a vital part of what we do here at the center and crucial obviously to getting our horses adopted. So we're going to introduce you to several of our horses. Some have been here a long time, some have been here a very short time and we're going to talk about our approach to training and how we get them ready for adoption. So here we go. Hi, I'm Abby. This is Studio. Um, Studio is like an appendix. She is a very sweet girl. She came here on an abandonment case. Um, when she arrived, she had something that's called sarcoids. Um, and it's basically like little tumors that they can have or large tumors that are generally cancerous. Um, she was on medical hold for quite a while when we first got her because she had to go through the treatment to um, just treat those sarcoids and help them, you know, heal back up. Right now, she um, is pretty good. She came here with one other horse, and that horse has been adopted, but the studio here has actually been here for quite a while. So today we're just going to be working on some round pin work to help her um, be able to learn a few things and find them. going to do a little bit of line driving today along with his buddy who you will meet next. Hi, I'm Nicole and this is Ponyo. He is a crummy gelding that arrived here as a colt. Um, he just had his first ride under saddle yesterday, so today we are going to continue that and show you how we saddle break them and bring them along. Studio has gone in the round pen several times, so she knows a little bit about 
push her too much. Don't want to upset her or make her nervous. So right there, she's not really paying attention to me, and I don't like that, so I'm going to push her on a little bit.
she's given me what I've asked for. That's where we're gonna stop. Um, so I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna spend a little time with her because you know we pressure and release, but it's really important that the whole time you spend with the horse is not working them and making them do things. Um, it's really important that you also spend you know a few minutes to, to say good girl, make sure that they know that they did what was right. Um, and that way they build a relationship with you. So we're just gonna end on that note. Um, put our halter back on, spend a little time with her, and good to go.